Y'all, this was either the smartest thing I've ever done or the dumbest. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> we are on a run. We're doing something a little different today. Uh, <clears throat> a lot of you aren't gonna like it. I know you're here for bus renovation videos, but hear me out. Someday my bus is going to be finished and you're going to have to deal with videos about vegan recipes and traveling and running. <laughs> so I think we should pull the band-aid off now because I've done something. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if it was a good idea or not. <sighs> I need a minute. Look who came with me. Lily. Hey sugar. Oh she's so fast. <laughs> okay. So, <clears throat> what am I doing? Well, a few things. First of all, I have made a healthy wage. It is not a amount of money I have earned yet. It is an app. This is how the app works. You, you bet money against yourself that you can lose weight. Um, I bet $100 per month for six months that I could lose 50 pounds. If I lose 50 pounds in that amount of time, I get not only the $600 I put in, but another like 450. I get back just over a thousand. If I don't reach my distance, goal, one mile, time, 12 minutes, five seconds. Yeah, I'm a little rusty, we'll get to that. <clears throat> um. Oh, we're going up a hill. Oh. Um, sorry, I know y'all didn't come here to hear me breathe heavy. <laughs> if I don't reach my goal, I lose all my money. All of that money goes to this company and to fund other people's payments who are successful. I was going to do a smaller amount of money, but then I realized, you know what? 20 bucks a month is not really enough to motivate me. But $600 a month? No, sorry. $600 total? Heck yes! I don't have $600 to throw out. So, I just did my initial weigh-in. 271 pounds. I've hit it hard the first two days. I'm already down five pounds. Five and a half pounds. Uh, it's water weight, it's not real fat. But whatever, the pounds. So, I have until July 25th to reach my goal weight of 221, which that's not my goal weight, goal weight, but that's my 50 pound mark. I wanted to do something that I thought was super attainable as to not lose $600. So let me give you a little backstory on me. You know that I'm building a school bus, but you don't know, or maybe you do, I don't know. Some of you don't know. Uh, I, once lost 100 pounds from running, from trail running, from ultra running specifically. I have not run all winter. I was super burnt out, needed a break. I have gained a really unhealthy, like 35 pounds back. Oh, right? So, it's coming off. <laughs> not only is it coming off, all of my extra weight is coming off. I haven't been this motivated in a long time. I've added this, this bet to push me along. And so, I'm not gonna bore you with a bunch of weight loss videos, but I am going to check in every month or so with a quick video. We'll go for a run. We'll talk about my progress. And, oh, fingers crossed, y'all. <laughs> uh, that thousand bucks is coming my way July 25th which is five days before my birthday. So that'd be a great birthday gift to myself, I think. Okay, so I told you that I do ultra marathons. Distance, two miles. Time, 25 minutes, 14 seconds. Previous mile in, 13 minutes, eight seconds. Well, it's my first run back, it's okay. Um, 
ultra marathons. What's an ultra marathon? An ultra marathon is <coughs> technically any distance over a marathon, which is 26.2 miles, but typically a 50K, which is like, what, 31 point something miles is considered the first ultra marathon distance. Um, then there are 50Ks, I mean 50 milers, 100Ks, which are 70, I don't know, 70-ish <laughs> miles, 71 something, <clears throat> 100 milers and beyond. There are 107 milers, 120 mile runs. So I've done some 20 mile runs, some 50Ks, um, a couple of 50 milers, and I've attempted three 100 milers. I've only completed one of them. Um, the other two, I missed the time cutoffs. One was at 51 miles and the other was at mile 47 or something. Anyway, I was super burnt out <laughs> uh, this fall and I needed a break. So I haven't run in four months, but I'm getting back to it. And I'll give you the shorts. Oh, I gotta catch my breath first. I'll tell you a little story. You coming, Lil? Oh yeah. Okay, I'll make this story short because most of you have already heard it. But the reason I got into running, the reason I lost 100 pounds to begin with, uh, was I lost my mom to heart disease. Obesity related heart disease, among other illnesses. And uh, she was only 58, which is too young to die of a preventable disease, if you ask me. So I just didn't want to end up the same way. <laughs> I didn't want to end up in the same boat. So I did a lot of things. I started losing weight, started running and training for my first 100 mile ultra marathon. I also decided that it was time just to take life by the little cojones. And if there's something I wanted to do, I needed to do it. I, oh, I thought there was a car behind me. <laughs> I had always wanted to write my first hour uh, comedy show. So I wrote my first hour stand up slash storytelling show. Uh, I always wanted to make a film a documentary film. So cameras followed me during the process of training and running my 100 mile ultra marathon. And my film is a juxtaposition of that show that I wrote and uh, the documentary. Um, and I've said since I was in high school that I wanted to travel full time, that I couldn't wait until I could retire so that I could buy an RV and travel full time. Why wait until you retire? Why not buy a school bus and do it right now? So that's my story. It wasn't so short, was it? <laughs> uh, my film, I'll put the link in the description box below. It's not done, but it's really close. And I'm really excited about it. It turns turning out way better than I ever could have imagined. So that's good news. Very good news. Um, what else? So today I'm running six miles, quick little six mile run, which should not be this hard <laughs> for me. Um, I mean, I remember when I first started running, I, mean, I literally couldn't run more than a quarter of a mile. <laughs> so it sounds silly to say that six miles should be easy, but I've taken time off and I wasn't good about staying in shape. So this is what I get. <laughs> uh, I am in the coolest cemetery. I always take a loop through it. Um, it's out in the middle of nowhere. I'm sure you can see uh, cornfields, cornfields, <laughs> cornfields. The closest town is uh, <clears throat> 12 miles away, something like that. It's called Stucker Cemetery. It's so pretty and so gorgeous. And people are still buried here, but let me find them there on the other side, I think. Um, there are tombstones going all the way back to the Civil War. Pretty darn cool. The Civil War started in what? 1864, is that right? I think so, right? 1865? Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I think that's it. 
Um, well, I don't know. We'll find out. Because I know which ones are from that time. <coughs> okay. I gotta breathe again. I'm so sorry. I know, y'all. We're not, like, hoping and praying for an eight-minute video of me breathing heavy. Okay, so here's some of the really old ones. It's hard to read them. Oh. Yeah. Can't read that one. I don't know. Uh, nope. That one's gone. Um, uh, 1892. This one. No. Um, okay, so here we go. There's 1877. That's getting close to Civil War. Can't, can't read this one. Oh, yeah, maybe. Nope. I don't know. This might not be interesting to anyone else. I think it's really cool. Yeah, we can't read those. This one, I mean, this one's wild, you know? The crazy thing is, the ones that are that old, um, it's not that crazy, but I mean, they wouldn't have been buried in, you know, like a coffin like we have. They would just be buried in like a wooden box, if that. Yeah, there we go, 1865. That's so cool. I think it's so cool. I love American history. Um, I don't know, I just think that's cool. Um, anyway, it's crazy to think that like, I don't know, I guess it's not that crazy. What am I even talking about? I'm rambling. Distance, six miles. Time, one hour, 18 minutes, 37 seconds. Previous mile in, 12 minutes, 14 seconds. <clears throat> Okay, hey, we're done. We, I'm done. You just watched. <laughs> uh, that's pretty rough, but it could have been worse. Hey, <clears throat> I know y'all came here for bus videos, so thanks for sticking it out. I promise I won't make too many of these, but I'm going to be making more and more over the next year, too. Um, hey, if you want to do a healthy wage, I'll put the link in the description box. I am pretty optimistic about it. I think... It's going to keep me super motivated. Uh, we'll see. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'll let you know. You can follow along. Bye. Did I just hear you say that you desperately want access to insider information and special perks? Well, check out my Patreon page right here. And don't forget to subscribe right here or just watch another video right here. Do, uh, you know, do all the, do all the things. Do them all.